It's one of those damn indoor skydiving rigs. It totally is. It's huge. Did you just build one to see what it looks like? I ain't gonna hurt nothing. We got plenty of space up here. We'll just, uh, just put it here. Can they walk underneath it? I don't even know. It, oh, it's invalid. Uh, why? Does it have to be... It needs space on the bottom. As well as the top. Let's, uh, let's raise it up a little bit. Maybe it needs more. Invalid build. So it's because it needs to be... Oh, maybe it does need to be... Oh, I see. It needs to be... Ah, the bricks need to go through the floor. I see. Whoa. So then... It needs to be clear on the top and the bottom. Can I put it here? Oh my god, I can. <laughs> Martha's bed! <laughs> oh my god. Martha's gonna be sleeping. It's just gonna just... We'll find out. I have no idea how much power it takes. I have, I've never built one of these things. The real question is, uh, can, if we get enough of them, can we uh, can we propel the asteroid through space? Just just forgo the whole. Let's let's not worry about building rocket ships or anything. We'll just shoot the whole damn thing across space. Uh, let's see, just wires. Oh, it needs a power wire, huh? Twelve hundred. Wow. This one is uh, yo. That one's being used though. Uh, the boombox would be a problem. Use a lot of power, man. Although that's potential power consumed. I suppose as long as this is not on, or maybe if one is on, the other one's off. <laughs> Victor! Oh my god! Will it work with that one? It's outside. Let me see. It is recommended. Yeah, sure, whatever. I just want to see somebody use it. I think we should probably disable this arcade cabinet just in case. There we go. Food's going great. Oh, here we go. Let's put something here. Oh, there we go. Hold on. Wait, wait. Oh, it's killing demon. Let me see. What should go in there first? Uh, buddy bud seed. Yeah. Slow down a little bit. He got left his balloon outside. He's I he even has his little helmet. <laughs> it's so perfect. Wow! <laughs> Screenshot that. Uh. So he's obviously pumped. <laughs> oh, my. oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, let me kick that. Pause it. Oh man, that is just amazing! Wow, Adonis. <laughs> I like how Boots just chilling. So wow, they're getting their fix, man. Huh. I But it's it's time to go to sleep. Okay, killing demon's good. Let me see, is he popped eardrums? Boy, shock, I wonder why. Uh airborne. Minus 15% per cycle. Wow. Oh, he's a night owl. Oh, does he have the right schedule? <laughs> Donna sees the neighbor when he sees a snake pit. Oh, man. Look at him. Popped eardrums. Night of hungry. He's hungry. Is he just going to stay in there the whole night? I can't believe how long it takes, actually, for them to uh, to get through this. He's airborne, so it's, it's going to pop the eardrums. So wait, hold on a second. Can you see this? Look. He's actually, like... His airborne and his popped eardrums are basically negating each other. Like, <laughs> he's gaining nothing from this. I guess what you should do is have them in suits. Before they go in, maybe? I, 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 they gotta be tired. Right? Like, he hasn't gone to sleep yet. They're gonna... I think he's mad. Look at Boots. Yeah. 
What a strange device. Uh. <coughs> well, I, I don't know. I don't even know what to say. Like, it, it's keep, it's keeping them up all night. It's a problem, right? It's a problem. Yeah, do you see Boots? Do you see Boots come landing? Like, like Donis gets down. He's just like ah, like freaking out. And Boots just kind of like just kind of floats down. Just walks away. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't know if we need this. <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather them stay in the recreation room we just built. Oh, you got it! <laughs> I love that they all have different animations for it. Wow, it comes down in a second though. Wow, that was fast. All right, let me see. What else can I hook them up with? I mean, it's a hot tub, mechanical surfboard. That makes uh, a mess. Juicer. The monument. Oh, huh. Need steel and obsidian. Yikes. Does it move air from one area to the other quickly? I, I didn't see any airflow. Like, usually you could see that. Yeah, no, no, definitely not because it would be... There'd be a temperature difference here between the two. Like, this green would not match this green kind of thing. So, yeah, no, it does not. That's unfortunate, too. Okay, so... Let's see. What's our next emergency? Um... Dormant. Dormant. Okay, so power is going to be our next emergency. We're still feeding hydrogen into this space. We've not bothered to, to get rid of the oxygen, which is also okay. The hydrogen has pretty much cleared itself out of here, which means it's up here now. Yup. And building. So we got a good amount of hydrogen building up over there. She has to jump through some hoops to get there, doesn't it? God, look at all this coal. We have just like an unbelievable amount of coal, I'm sure. Consumable ore. 149 tons of coal, guys. I don't really know what to do with that. What do I even do with that? I just... I can run coal generators for the rest of time. Um... When is this thing not dormant? 30 cycles. This one, 39 cycles. Thankfully, we have a ton of petroleum. Like a ton. So I think we'll be fine. We'll be fine. Huh. Yeah, I wanted to clean up the kitchen. I thought Boost was going to do it. But yeah, I'll probably have to just open up the door. Let them in. There you go. I thought it was a storage issue, but I think it's really just that. Is it a storage issue, though? No. No. Eee. That's the other problem that we were having that we didn't, never tackled. <clears throat> was doing something about the lack of uh, proper storage. So we could build another row down here and just have it extend out further. That's a good idea. Let's see. This one I thought just make by hand. I'll have a preset that would work for this guy, I think. So we'll cut through some of this obsidian, maybe. Maybe. That's a big, that's a huge maybe, actually. We could do one, two. Then we could just paint some blocks around those. Yeah, it'll work. Uh, coal can be used in a kiln to produce refined carbon. Oh, that's right. Yeah, thank you, Victor. I totally forgot about that. And then what we'll do is I don't think we have to get down there like ever, but just in case we leave a gap. Mesh tile. Plastic ladder, plastic this, plastic. So this isn't gonna add like a ton of. Uh, oh, they can't get down there with that anyways. So, yeah, it's fine. Um, it's not gonna add a. Ton. Oh shit, no, not enough space. Hold on. Did make it lower. So we'll start a little bit lower than that. Let me see. Cause we have to put some up here as well. So basically, I want these here, here 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 and then want to put these down one so yeah I think I will cut through a little bit of the subsidian here which pains me but oh uh, wait can they get through so you can walk down there you can step down I think a step down in here it's hyper annoying for them not to get anything but let's start with this and then this guy is gonna be an issue let's go ahead and do this and let's put a couple ladders here 
And then we'll make some mesh tiles out of what? Uh, aluminum? I'll oh, sure, aluminum, yeah. Then... That's fine over there. The one lone one over there. Actually, we're gonna put one more in that corner. And then a couple more mesh. So mesh, 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 mesh. And they should be able to reach all that. Good, good, good. They can put two more right here. Can they reach all the way down there? Oh, not when I put the mesh up, though. So, what do I want to do? Yeah, they'll be able to reach that one. And this will be fine all the way around, so. Yeah, this will work. It's kind of jank, but it works. It's kind of a small expansion on the, uh, on our setup here. And then what we'll do is we'll uh, run the conveyor around and that'll be that. So let's see. Shipping, conveyor rail, let's see, copper ore. What do we have the most of? Looks like it's probably gonna be iron ore. So we'll just basically bypass this guy. And work our way down. And then we'll probably feed one and then feed a second one here. So there we go, that's what we'll do. So conveyor loader, oops, uh, uh, one. Oh god, oh dang it, I tried to beat the, the save. Now let's see what it does. Oh, where'd it put it? Eh, who knows. It's a very satisfying sound. So this will help significantly with uh, just storage in general. And we need power down there too. Oh, look at that. How, how, how handy. Then, uh, there. It's gonna be one of those setups you could tell that was like an afterthought to build this down here. All right, so let's go to the kiln. We do have a kiln over here that has nothing in the, uh, look at that, cold refined carbon. I wonder if we should move that kiln. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, we're getting low, which means we're on this reserve now. Hmm. And we still have many, many cycles, 30 cycles. So this is going to get a workout, these things are. We should probably get these things up and running too. Even though we're kind of stealing all that hydrogen. So we don't have a lot of hydrogen to give it. Uh, we could actually go ahead and snip that. I think we're done feeding that thing hydrogen. There, let that just continue to build up there. And then we'll swap this out for... Actually, we just go and repair it. Because it's not going to be that hot anymore. I think it'll be okay. Uh, but yeah, so let's get a kiln set up going somewhere that we can afford the power. Where well, the power, but the, uh, what? Oh, let's put them right here. They can get there pretty quickly, right? Let me see. Uh, maybe over here. I think down here would make the most sense, right? Like, it's not gonna melt down. Aluminum ore. I mean, it hasn't melted down, just chilling there, so obviously that's fine. But this is faster, access-wise, so I think it'll be pretty fine. Is there a byproduct to making that stuff? Who cares? Let's go ahead and put a couple kilns down here. We'll come down here, zoom, get that done, come up here, or maybe right here, actually. Perfect. That's what we'll do. So let's see, refinement. From kilns, we'll do like, uh, we'll do a couple. What is it made out of? Uh, aluminum. Let's not do that. <laughs> I know, I was just like, oh no, it's fine, aluminum, it works. For the other side, but no, I don't trust it. I don't really don't trust it overall. Let me see. Make it out of steel. There we go. And we'll put a gap in between as well. There we go. That'll work. All right, cool. So we'll get those going and uh, start making some uh, some resources to make more steel, basically. Yeah, yeah. We solved a lot of problems, and we still got time. I like it. Except for the whole, we're going to run out of natural gas here soon. That's going to be a problem. Actually, how's that going to bode? That's not going to bode well for this setup here. What if we should have like one tank that's dedicated just to this, you know? To, just to bridge the gap. If, so let's do this. If this runs out, which I, I imagine it probably will run out of natural gas, then we will dedicate one tank just to that. We'll have to redo these stuff. Look at this nonsense. Mess of wire of ducting all over the place. Anyways, let me see. How are we doing down here, guys? Good, it's moving. Can we get this cleaned up? All that just to get this cleaned up. Salt water. Ooh. Reject. 
nothing to do. I want nothing to do with that. Are they not going to repair this, I wonder? They can reach it. Huh. Oh, okay, weird. Okay, now it showed up. Okay, there it is. Okay. Yeah, they could get in. It just wasn't showing up on that list for some reason. Some weird, weird shit. Don't need this anymore. Don't need that either. That's regulating itself. This is a mess. <laughs> this is such a mess. How does this even happen? It's gonna flood this thing. Okay, cool. And then carbon. Refined carbon. Forever. Refined carbon. Forever. Ceramic. We're gonna need some ceramic eventually too. Clay, which we have a lot of. Ceramic, which we have. How much ceramic do we have overall? Oh, we don't have a lot, so let's do that. So he's gonna go through coal and clay. Totally fine. Roast! Look at that. And these are all, everything around here is steel. So I can't imagine anything's gonna melt. Maybe some of this stuff over here, maybe? This, oh, this is made of iron. Oh my god. <sighs> is that gonna melt? Well, let's see, status, uh, it doesn't say what it's, what point it's going to take damage, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe it'll be okay. Oh man, just one more, guys. Almost, we're almost done here. Almost done. It's a construction. Fuck, I go to sleep. <laughs> uh, copy settings. Get some product move. At the least, very least here. Let me see, copy settings. Give it a second. Duh, tons of clay in this channel. Ah, X. There we go. Get them, get them, get them, get them now. Look at that. Now we can actually clean up some of this mess that we've been working on forever. Look at this. Look at this, finally. Oh, it's beautiful. And if we just finish, just finish these last few things, guys. Unreachable. Oh. Oh, it is indeed unreachable. Look at that. How do they get the rest of the shit done? Oh, they must have done that in like sections here. How funny. Can they... Yeah, they can step from there to there. Cool. Don't need that one. And that'll solve the problem. Good. Perfect. 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 Oh, God. Donis. Almost. Is it just stopping there? Where's it going? Hold on. Oh, it's... Okay, never mind. It's going now. Whatever. Uh, I'm gonna try the Amazon game tomorrow. Uh, which one? I don't have any Amazon games on my, on my radar at the moment. Oh, hmm. I just wanna get rid of these drains. I don't like these notices here. Man, we'll finally get this area clean. Is it really that hot in here? 130 degrees? Jeez. Crucible, huh? Let me pull that up. I'll take a look at it. <clears throat> yeah, I'll take a look at it. Uh, oh, it's a Fortnite style game? Free to play multiplayer game? Hmm. We'll take a well, yeah, I'll take a look at it and see. <clears throat> yeah, I'll take a look. I'll take a look at it tonight and see uh, what it is, and um, if it's something that looks like you know. Might be kind of fun. Then it's free to play, so maybe we'll go and check it out. Can't really. I mean, I don't know what information. Like, if they have like a launch, they have a launch launcher or something like that. Like, is that insufficient? Oh, that's fine. We'll see. Oh, it's on Steam. Oh shit. Okay, cool. I just assume that they had a launcher, of course. <laughs> this damn industry. 
Everyone's got their own damn launcher. Salt water. Nope. Okay, cool. Hey, we made a whole bunch more uh, storage. That's awesome. We can actually afford to get stuff cleaned. Why is that not picking up? Oh, maybe we should just tell it to do everything. There we go. Do that for across the board here. Except for edibles, though, because, uh, oh, there's no robots over here to clean anything up, so. What are we going to do with this space? You would think it would be on the Twitch launcher. Yeah, huh, actually. Jeez, yeah, I didn't even think about that. <laughs> you would think. You would think. Oh, why is this disabled? This stuff is not done. They're not done making food yet. Oh, because this one's on the line, isn't it? No, it's not. It should only send a stop when it's full, right? Hold on, let me do this. Ah, I need a, that's right, I need a knot in there. That's what it is. Dang it. You're not, uh, there we go. Yeah, we'll split this. There. <laughs> Makes sense. A knot. Knot. <laughs> God. <coughs> laughing like an idiot. <coughs> Make me cough. Oh no. They're not happy. There's too many of them. Hold on, let me see. Uh, overcrowded glum. Oh, wait, wait a second then. Let's see, idle team overcrowded. Which one of these? Oh, those. 1825, 025, 1925, 1125, 1825, 7. And these are a bunch of babies. This is the oldest one, it looks like. Uh, this one here. 1925. There we go. There we go. Alright. We set a sacrifice one. <laughs> For the greater good. Alright, so this area is clean. Uh, it's getting cleaner by the minute. Which is great. We can clear out all of this nonsense. All of these. Yeah, everything. Uh, why don't we go ahead and build up this floor again. Is that obsidian? Let's not use obsidian. That's that stuff is clearly coming in handy elsewhere. As you've discovered. Sedimentary rocks, fine. Did you say Twitch has a launcher now? <laughs> they, they do actually have a, uh, a launcher. A game launcher, don't they? Yeah. Okay, waiting for materials. I wonder if we should put a couple of bins for coal down here. Coal and clay. Coal and clay. Yeah, because that's nonsense. What they're doing right now, running down here every single time. Might as well just have them all come down here and supply these things and then uh, get to work. Just transfer things over as they need it. Can you use a sweeper for this? Will a sweeper actually load the kiln? And unload the kiln? It's called a Twitch app. Yes? That might be an option. Food is decayed. What? Sleet wheat grain. Oh, why is there sleep? Uh oh. How much food is in here? Why is there sleet wheat grain in here? Uh, let's see. Organic. Oh, seed. Okay, good. It's a seed. That's, um. That's fine. Although, no, no, never mind. Because nosh bean and all that stuff. Ugh, damn it. So nosh bean, pinch of pepper seed, uh, seed thimble reed, see, yeah, that's fine. Water weed seed is fine as well. I'm missing one. Am I missing one? Maybe not. Anyways, let's see, copy settings. Oh, I didn't really see anything fall out, so I guess it's not a whole lot. Oh yeah, there's a couple right here. Pinch of pepper seed. That's fine. It's good. This, so it wasn't like a ton of seeds down there. I'd be pretty upset if there was. <laughs> this whole time, just like throwing away food down there. 
Is that is that also yeah, is it manual use? Okay, cool. Sticks to keep loading this thing up. No manual use anymore. Although, I mean, this this is not a bad way of getting material from one end to another. Maybe we should uh, think about putting some of the, one of those up a little bit closer to, like over here or something like that. That way, it just pulls material over this way. Okay, so these are done. We'll do clay for one. What is it under consumable ore for consumable ore? Coal. And then what is, let's make that a nine. And then clay is going to be under, fuck, what is that even? Miscellaneous? No. Raw mineral? Nope. Industrial ingredient? Okay, no. <laughs> Uh, cultivable soil? Weird sound. Yeah, what's that? Oh, there it is. I had no idea. Cool. <clears throat> yeah, it's also a model loader. That's what we use for, uh, Declan for, uh, for Minecraft. We use the Twitch launcher for that, and it does a pretty good job. If there's any reason... Okay, they could already get over here this way. Okay. Can I make them eject here and then also go that direction? Like, is that... No, I don't think so. Well, I could... No, no, it wouldn't work. I was trying to see, if maybe give them a reason to drop right here or something, but eh, it's not worth my time. Okay, so, uh... This didn't last. But it should freeze, which means they're gonna load it back up again. So some of these lasted, but not the other ones. This is, I, you know, I said earlier, what does that smell? Oh, Jen's making sauce. Huh. It's the onions. Huh. Delicious. Um, <clears throat> anyways, I, I still believe that having a bunch of tiles, temp shift plates, uh, made out of ice as a backing plate to this is beneficial overall. We just don't have enough. We need more is the problem. So what we'll do is uh, we'll wait until this thing gets like, the, the, they will eventually freeze and then uh, we'll load them back up into uh, and build just like one small like area here. And those will stay frozen. And then once we get more, we'll extend it out slowly. But that'll totally work. It just takes time. Time and ice. Okay. So, some cleanups happening. We, the, uh, the machines are on, enabled, good. And, oh, it's cooking, okay, cool. That's what, that's what I want to see. Ah, okay, yes, yeah, so we are running out. We could actually inject a whole bunch real quick because we do have some in here. This is 2,000, so we do have a bunch of natural gas we have that we could use as an emergency, emergency measure. Why would they go in there? That's why there's so much hydrogen in there. They keep going in there for some reason. Anyways, um... Yeah, I think we should do, what we should do is go ahead and uh, make a, let's go and clean us up a little bit. And we'll make this one bin that's specifically for boots and the, uh, the broiler, the, the, the grill. So we'll go and get rid of this, this. I mean, thankfully it's already mostly set up. <laughs> that's all we gotta do is just this. Get all that X'd out. Easy. Put boots in a bin. <laughs> He's our cook, man. Man's gotta do work. And then we'll cut this across here. Cut this. And then that should cancel that. Cool. Alright, so once they're once they get around to doing all this shit, then then we'll kick it on. Uh, we'll be able to load it up. But we should probably go ahead and do this temporarily as well, just to make sure that, that gets loaded up. So what's the deal, guys? What's the deal? Oh, it's because it's not an emergency. That's why. How's the Tampa AATN? I'm glad you asked. Whoa, man. Uh, yikes. You know what it is? It's the water. The water has finally won. Nine degrees. Ooh, man. It's still, I mean, it's getting hydrogen. Yeah, it's got plenty of hydrogen, so it's not like it's running out of hydrogen. It's purely because the liquid that we're pumping through is too fucking 
hot. So I guess we lower it. Where is it at right now? 400. I did say that we were going to uh, shut this off, use the, like, attach the water shut off to shut it off whenever it gets a certain temperature, and I never went and did that. Um, I can see where I could slide one in using the build at an angle maneuver. What is that? It looks like you need to tie in another cooling loop by the AATN if you have enough weeds. I do, I do, but I don't think I need to do that yet. I think what I could do, because I think I have a lot of uh, sleet wheat, like a ton. Let me see. Cook ingredients. Uh, I have two tons, actually. So I don't know what that really amounts to total. Like, what is one single unit? One single unit is 18 kilograms? Oh, no, there's 18 of them there. <gasps> Okay, it's refrigerated and fresh. They will eventually go to get it, but no, what I'm thinking is, um... I will lose ATMs forever, like since I got the game. You never, never spawned for you? I, I feel like every map has, well, I guess, I guess, uh, one, but you may not get that one. Let me, uh, let me see. So first, let's go and put a temperature sensor, and we'll put it right at the entrance here. Water sensor. What am I looking for? Uh, temperature thermo sensor. Here we go. And we'll put that right here. Ooh, we're gonna get in the. W oh, this is perfect actually because we want to attach it to that anyways. Uh, will it act as an ore? It should. We'll see what happens. It'll shut off the water. Yeah, that, that's. I already have it set up so that whenever it gets to, whenever the water gets backed up, that so gets up to here and it stays there, then it will, you know, move to there. Uh oh, was she watching the stream? What did she say? Ah, <laughs> the snake! <laughs> Please don't post pictures of snake. You don't know what our experiences are. Rebecca Ford. <laughs> Please. Okay. Yeah. So let's do this then. I. Uh, wow. We filled this room with hydrogen. By the way. What the? Oh, because we keep pumping it in. No, we're not pumping it in. Why all of a sudden we have so much hydrogen? I mean, it's not going to come pushing in here, right? What do we have? We're, yeah, the, and if anything, the oxygen is going to win that fight for sure. So let's do this. Um, this is going to be complicated. Oh, actually, you know what? No, it's not. We just built from the top. 9 degrees, 30 degrees. So we would lose some temperature. We could just do it real quick. Just get in there, just zip, 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 done. So let's go and get the uh, automation going. Let me see. So here to here. We might have to put like an, an ore gate or something, but once we get that in, then we're good. So we'll deconstruct that, and then we'll make this all, this whole deal here, all an emergency. This one right here, though, could be a nine. Just please hurry, please hurry, please hurry, please hurry. I'm losing all my precious hydrogen. Come on. Let's go. Build it. Build it, build it, build it, build it, build it, build it. Good. Okay. Emergency. Uh, what can I use? What's in the area? What's this? Gold amalgam. Oh, here we go. Uh, granite. There's a granite right there. Granite. There we go. Got it. Okay, good. Nobody's going to sleep till this is done. Good. Cool. So now, uh, we can tell it to shut off this water shut off uh, when it reaches, let me see. So send a green signal uh, if it is above, uh, well, we want to send a green signal to send water if it's below, um, what? Negative or zero, maybe let's say zero. So it's ending a red now. Ah, yeah. So we're, we are going to need to put a, a, a knock gate or a um, another gate here. Let me see automation or gate or there we go. So we'll do that. That's not bad. Let's save the one and then we'll patch the other one into the other one here. Let me see. So, uh, uh. 
Then we'll start a snippy snip. You can reach all that. Yeah, they can reach all that. Cool. So we're now sending a. Oh damn it! I need an and gate. <laughs> Fuck. Not an or gate. Hurry up. <laughs> we need an and gate. And gate. How's the liquid copper? Oh, one, 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 one major catastrophe at a time, please. <laughs> All right, so this will shut off the water, so that means the sleet wheat here is not going to get any water for a good minute uh, while this continues to recover. But the good news is that once it does recover, then it's going to pump some water in, and obviously it's going to uh, uh, warm it up. So it'll basically shut off, let some water in, shut off, let some water in, shut off, and it'll just repeat that process over and over again. But what we should do is probably set this thing to something crazy low, and they could just not have sleet wheat for bread and all that stuff uh, and just suffer. <laughs> for a while. It is erupting. We don't have any... Oh, there's some copper down here, actually. Right there. So it is erupting. Oh shit, this is live. <laughs> I need to get another drink, damn it. Uh-oh. Oh, whoops, I forgot to pay pay my model on Sunday, whoops. Do you want them spoilers? Spoilers, I forgot to pay my model. <laughs> oh, Woovy. Wait a minute, does that mean they're repairing this thing? Don't, uh, disable auto repair. And also disable the building. I always expect it to like, but you never, never really get that kind of satisfaction, you know? Here it comes. Blah, blah, blah. It's uh, yeah, it's it's not uh, it's turning into a solid down here. It will eventually turn into liquid copper. It's gonna take a long time though. Yeah, you see, it's starting to pool a little bit. It eventually, it'll be enough, and it'll just stay pooled. It's gonna erupt again. Another cycle. Wow. Okay, how's this guy doing? Jeez, man. Thank God you made me go check. Jesus. Yeah, so once it gets a certain tempo. Yeah, yeah, so that's what we're doing. We're, we're just shutting off the water and we're letting it cool. And it is, it's starting to cool a little bit. A future Michael fix it. There you go. There you go. Temp shift plate. Kind of watching that real quick. Let's speed this up a little bit. Yeah, it's getting colder. There we go. So we'll come back and check on it again, but right now it will definitely regulate itself down to zero and it'll just keep it there. Um, indefinitely, so good. Uh, lots of hydrogen in there, by the way. Let's come back to that. And, you know, with all of this... With all of the plastic that we have, I think we should start putting some... Use some of that plastic throughout the base here. Our, uh, this is all fine. I think we should replace all the solid plates, all the solid uh, tiles with plastic, just so they can move quicker across all this. <clears throat> How do we have? Hold on, hold on, hold on. How do we have four hundred and sixteen thousand kilocalories, but this thing's only half full? This is all cooking ingredients, so they can't eat any of this stuff. What is in here? Mmm, edible. Ah, they're hiding that food down. Nah, look at that, hiding that food down there. Get out of here. Wow, it was all that. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's that's absurd. That's absurd. Uh, anyways, let me see. Anyone can go through here. Let's go and stop that again. Oh, Biffy's stuck. Get out of Buffy. <laughs> there. Now let's put some plastic up everywhere. Plastic. I mean, it's not that important. <laughs> Just kind of like whenever you can get to it, guys. Let's do the inside parts here, maybe? I don't know. It's like a plastic base. Just everywhere. But car <laughs> carpet tile? I know. Yeah, jeez, carpet tile. 
But we have all this plastic we have to go through, man. Like, what are we gonna do with all this damn plastic? Think of the decor. Think of the decor, man. We've got so much plastic. It's really ridiculous. No one man should have so much plastic. Even in here, look at this. We should go ahead and uh, do the same here. Oh, this is not a recreation room, is it? Because of there's uh because there's a uh Oh. <laughs> oh man. Uh you, wow, so the the dock area is a recreation room. 